In this video, I'm going to show you how to close multiple gaps on your timeline right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's get right into the video. Now, on a previous video, I showed you the technique of how to close down gaps on your timeline between two video clips. But the problem is if you've got 20, 40, 50, 100, 200 clips on your timeline, they're all spaced apart and you need to close all of those gaps. It's going to take forever to go through all of those individual gaps backspace and delete all of those spaces. Now, if you did want to do it this way, then the technique for this is to simply select the gap between one of your clips. So we'll select this gap here, press the backspace button, and that's going to get rid of that gap. And it will shift everything on the right of the cursor over to the left, as long as the layer isn't locked. But as I say, if you have all of these different video clips, as you can see on my timeline, we have multiple different video clips. If you have all of these clips, then it's going to take you forever to do this technique. So I'm going to show you a slightly different workaround and that's going to close all of the gaps on the timeline at the same time. Now, once you're inside of Adobe Premiere Pro, you want to make sure that all of your clips are sitting on the same layer. If there's clips up on layer two, layer three, then this isn't going to work. So it's important that they're all compressed onto one layer. Now that all of your clips are on one layer, you want to go into new item, black video, we'll press OK and drag the black video onto video layer two. Now we'll make sure we extend the duration of this all the way over to the end clip. So make sure that covers the entire duration of the project from the start of the first clip and the end of the last clip. We want to select all of the video clips on the timeline except for the black video. We'll drag that up onto video layer two on top of the black video. So now we've got our black video in between all of those clips and then we'll drag the clips back down to video layer one. So as you can see on video layer one, we've got all of our video clips, but on video layer two, we've got the black video broken down to the specific duration of the gaps between the clips. Now from here, all you have to do is select all of those black video clips on video layer two. We'll right click or double click on one of the black videos, go up to ripple delete, and by doing so, you're going to get rid of all of those black videos. You're going to get rid of all of the spaces between the clips and you've got all of your clips perfectly sat right next to each other. Now, this is really simple, but it's a very effective tip and it's going to be super helpful when you're working on a larger video project. So if you enjoyed watching this video or if you feel like you learned something, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. See you on the next video.